of the P2P soccer tutorial of TV Co. When you have downloaded the software, just click on the VV player icon, click on execute and the program starts immediately. Now the first time it may be that the software requires an update, you will ask for it with a pop-up screen like this. Now just click OK and you can update the media player using the wizard. It may be that TVCO asks you this questions a few times. Just follow the same steps over and over again and after some once or twice it will run perfectly as it does. So now just click on run app. Now you can see a list of all the available channels on the right side of the media player. For instance, movies, uh, other TV and movie channels, for instance, you will find a sports channel BTV6. So you can easily scroll down and up. The most interesting sports channels, of course, you can find under cable TV. It's a very interesting section where you can find CCTV Sports, ESPN, Star Sports and QSIV. Now how does it work? Just simply double click on a channel and it will load in the media player on the left side. This is some ads showing now. On the top you can find some info about the stream, the speed, the buffering and so forth. And at the bottom, you find some useful tools to watch at full screen, to watch at your desk, mini bar or a mini video, for instance, like this. Let's go back. The stream is playing, but we cannot show it to you due to our recording uh, software. But let's play it in the media player. Just right click and select properties. Just copy and paste the address mentioned at the properties pane of the media player. Open your media player and paste the same address. Just click OK. And now you see that the media is playing in Windows Media Player. Now you can stop the stream in TV Go. Just click on the stop button below. Just this one, yes, okay. Now just minimize the TV Go player and you will have a perfect stream of Star Sports. Thank you for your time. Please visit p2psoccer.com.